Okay, welcome back to Taco Bowler Gaming. My name is Taco Bowler, and let's figure out a way to end this war. Uh, I'm going to tell them, go for Brussels and Antwerpen. And uh, go as quickly as you can. And uh, I want you to move this general direction. Um, I want you guys here... I want you there, and you're already moving in to Brest. So, uh, yeah, I guess actually, no, you can defend. That's fine. You move here. Defend the, the one naval invasion going on. Yep. So, uh, this is going very, very well. Um, if you're ready, you need to go. Because we need to get into Switzerland. We need to put some damage on those places. Um, you guys go up to Calais. You go to Dunkirk. If at all possible, we need to make sure that those nations, Switzerland and Belgium, are in the peace deal, because I would like to take them. Uh, since I, you know, utilize my one chance to attack them without fighting the British, who, frankly, I am scared of. Uh, if you haven't figured that out yet, I am very, very frightened of the British. Uh, we're going to get one more... Really? One more from them. We have some unused factories... And I think we need infantry equipment the most. Well, no. Let's go all in. We're going to go all in with tanks. Because... Um, I'm going to actually leave these dockyards. We'll just tell them to go on convoys. When the carrier is ready, we will make carriers. But until then, that's a big no. So they're going there. I want you actually to go right over here. You're going to put the squeeze on... Because I do believe that this war could end this episode. Now, this is 1943. Frankly, that's not that big of a deal. We don't have refineries. As in, I haven't built them. What is this? I'm going to go ahead and do this one. Well, it's ahead of time. Let's take a look. Oh, wow. I am behind here. So let's actually go back to this one. And we will do some of that. Actually, halt. Don't go into Calais because that could cause the French to capitulate. I mean, they're bound to be close. Uh, 72% of the way. But once we take uh, Antwerpen over here, you guys actually to come down here and join the line. This line. This actually cuts off the uh, Belgians and actually cuts off all of this, all the French troops over here, from their capital of Calais. I guess I need to actually take Dunkirk for that. So we'll just leave that there. 
and uh, essentially we have that surrounded. Um, you guys come over here. Um, actually, I don't think it's necessary to be there. You guys go to this group. We already have more military factories. Okay. Ooh, we have an outdated thing for artillery. One artillery. And, um... I'm going to put some into support equipment. We have several things of research that just went. Okay. Um, we will go ahead and do that. And that. And we're going to switch back over here. And get... This one. Liege is now <laughs> the uh, the main guy here. No, you're here. Don't worry about those in the slightest. Actually, you go through. You go here. It's like this should start to change. Now we need you guys moving. And that should help. Belgium will capitulate. And that will most definitely change the tide of the war. Um, which ones are you guys? You guys are this one? Delete that. I want you to have an offensive line up here. And again, I want you to just go. There it is. Belgium has capitulated to us. That's 27,000 stuff. I love, love, love to see that. Um, we are going to have them create an offensive line of, let's say, here, maybe? And again, just go. Oh, that was wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful to see. But I'm really hoping to avoid ending France. They've taken Calais, which is what it is. Hoping to avoid ending France. Until. Um, until uh, we have damaged Switzerland at all. Because it would seem that we have not done that yet. Everyone over here now. You guys to here. And we seem to not be holding air superiority over the channel. Is what it is. And actually unassign all regions from you. How might I do that? Hold air wings. There we go. Naval superiority is not as large of a deal considering. Actually, move over here.
That will be just fine. Need you guys to just go straight upward to burn. Don't worry about who's in your way. The Spanish will mop up. Because France is very close to capitulation, and I need that to change. I'm aware we have unused air wings. I specifically told them to unuse. Um, we're going to actually tell the people on the line to wait. I'm going to even tell this group to wait. The only people I want moving, excuse me, are the people who are attacking Switzerland. And I know that my allies will be probably moving in, but, you know, oh well. Sorry if that flashed there. Hey, there we go. Basically, if we can get through the line at any point, get into Switzerland. That's all, I think, that's all we need. just get into Switzerland. Make them take damage. Before France capitulates. And considering we're right on Metz over here, Um, that's pretty well unguarded. I think France capitulating is going to happen pretty soon. Hopefully it doesn't happen with ANSI over here. Come on. there's no one protecting the western part of Switzerland. So if we can, can get in there, it's going to be a free-for-all. That is reality. So that is definitely our goal. Come on. See, like things are going well over here. I have a feeling we're gonna do that. I hope we don't wind up where we can't take Switzerland. Not up to burn. Come on. There we go. We're moving. There's some friends who have decided to come visit. It is not going to be long at all. Let's go ahead and go speed five. Make it happen. Come on. 
and actually take these nine, say, you guys go this way to do it. Okay, I have free civilian factories. What is this nonsense? Uh, we do need to... I haven't developed a nuclear reactor yet. Okay. We probably need to build some civilian factories. All things considered. We are going to need trade. A lot more trade than I have had. Let's do five and five there. And let's get some more steel. From the Soviets. What's going to kill us is that... I think the Soviets are probably the next target. Um... They certainly make more sense than, say, the U.S. or Great Britain. And so, if we do attack the Soviets, then, you know, uh, that could create a problem. With all of our trade coming from the Soviets. They're in a war with Japan, and I don't really know how much. I would love to get Italy back on our side. It is very frustrating that... This is not working. Um, let's take these guys, cross, and go. I mean, that may capitulate France, but at this point, we can't get in any other way. You guys come through. Should help. We really, really, really need to be doing damage to Switzerland, if at all possible. You guys can halt. Come on. Move in here. I guess a 92 start. If that wins, then that's going to be great. Plan Z is over. Things are going well here. Maybe we can actually do it. I don't know. Um, that was Plan Z. We can now befriend Denmark. Ooh. get Denmark without having to fight the UK? That might be worth it. That might be worth it. Um, Legionary Romania is calling their forces back, which is fine. Oh, we only need 98 steel. The Soviet Union has none. Okay. Well, we'll get 21 from Nationalist Spain. 14 from Hungary. Okay. I guess some from the U.S. Switch our trading partners up. That works. Things are finally starting to change over here in Switzerland. I had really thought that this would go faster than this. Um, yeah, no, go this way. Straight up. 
I can counterattack in. Just to hold them in place. Some damage has happened in Switzerland, but they are holding all their victory points. That needs to change for us to be able to take anything from them. I'm confident of that. That at least is true. That if, if I want to take anything from Switzerland, I need to at least... I want you to, to halt, and I want you to go down here. Add your guns there. Come on, people. I am surprised that France has not capitulated. They have to be like 99% of the way. 94, okay. I did find it odd that someone in the war with me has given me expeditionary forces, so it's not really that much of a problem to me that they're being called back. Um, let's add you to the fight. Alright, now I would like First off, this needs the proper dispensary and we're going to reduce our convoys to five and we're going to build a carrier as much as we can get we have a slight steel shortage is what it is let's go ahead and do the US can I get more from you Spain I can Splendid. Only tons again. We're going to get better infantry equipment. That's a good one to be doing here. I still have a free dockyard. Let's go ahead and put it in convoys. That's fine. I feel like we're inches away. Nope, I want you to halt. I want you to go through here to here. They've returned their expeditionaries, which is fine. Get to burn. Is it really that hard to figure this out? That is what I want you to be doing. Lose this. Get to burn. That's all I care about. Spain will hold the line. Our allies will hold the line back here. Just get to Bern. Get to Switzerland. Because they literally have lost nothing. And it's over. France capitulated. So Switzerland... I mean, I can, I can take all of Switzerland, which is good. I would like to take... All of Belgium. Do I want to satellite things down here, actually? No, I think I'd take them all. Alright, we'll put them back. Yugoslavia? Uh, 
Um, I'm going to take land. Take that. I'm going to end my turn. And Spain took up some. So I think we could puppet Yugoslavia. Take some of Yugoslavia or more of France. I think I, I'm okay to leaving Yugoslavia for the most part. I think at this point I would like to take some Belgium and try and take some of France. We'll do that. I know that Spain is going to take quite a bit. Can't quite take all of Belgium. I'll just let's do this. My experience with puppeting these things has been that they haven't really given much. But if I just take it, the UK is just going to take it right back. So, I think we take some of this, some of France. I would really like to take that. That's all I can take, huh? Let's take what we can. Can't just fight them all. So let's just take this. They took that. That's fine. I can take Picardy. I guess we have to pass. And I'll take that. I'll take that. Now.
what is happening over here? Who's taking it? Spain's taking it? That's no fair. I want the rest of that, please. Alright, what I'm going to do is I am going to satellite. Now, actually, I'm going to puppet Belgium as a whole. And I'm going to puppet the rest of the French commune. Which I guess actually it was there. And then we start to satellite what we can. No. Um, as much as I would like that, well, I really would like that. as a navy base. Hit that until I can hit the take all states button. I'm not going to defend all of this, but I don't care. I think we end our turn. We are done. Peace conference is over. World tension is at 100%. We are going to just end here. Norway joined the United Kingdom. Is it like a puppet state? Yeah, they're just with the allies. Okay. So, uh, yeah. And let's see what the achievement was over here. Um, there was something for Germany, uh, as Imperial Germany, conquer Caribbean Island. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to leave this here, uh, and I will figure out what I want to do from this point forward, but uh, I think that uh, we're in an okay spot, relatively speaking at least, so I will uh, figure something out. We definitely are going to take this game to 1948 if possible. I am leaning towards saying that the Soviet Union is the next logical target, especially since that would probably bring us to um, um, what is this? That would bring us to a fight with, uh, or bring us to an alliance with Japan, which might be a good thing for us. But I've been Taco Bolo Gaming, and I hope you have enjoyed. If you have, please like, comment, and subscribe down below, and I will see you next time.